Hey everyone, today we got the full schedule for E3 2021. So I got it here. We're going to go over the full schedule for E3 2021. But more than going over that full schedule, we're actually going to go over the entire schedule that we have going on with E3. So this is sort of like announcing Nintendo's E3 schedule, announcing E3's E3 schedule, and then us also going over our entire show. So we're just going to go through the Nintendo Prime E3 show uh, that includes all of the E3 events. And you'll see, you know, it'll be pretty clear when the official events begin, if that's all you're interested in. But also, hey, why not find out what the hell we got going on as well? Now, before we get into all this E3 goodness, I got to mention that this video and part of our E3 coverage is brought to you by into the am they create amazing shirts such as this awesome printed tee right here uh, it actually glows in the dark and it's a very high quality print uh they also have a lot of standard basic tees along with other different clothing and i actually find myself wearing them every single day in fact i think i'm now on like 14 consecutive days of wearing into the am shirts they are so soft they are pre-shrunk uh, so whatever size you get, it's how it's going to fit no matter how many times you wash it. And yeah, it's just an amazing quality product. Otherwise, I wouldn't have partnered with them. Uh, so you can get 10% off on their website right now by going into the am.com slash Nintendo Prime 10. There will be a link down in the description. You can get three of the basic tees for $45. You can also get three of the printed tees like this one for $60. And yeah, they also have a t-shirt of the month club that you can actually join for free uh, using the Nintendo Prime 10 code and you'll get your first shirt for free if you decide to take advantage of that. So yeah, go check out intotheam.com slash Nintendo Prime 10. All right, let's just not waste any of your time because we got four days worth of stuff uh, to get to. I printed it off because it's just, it, it's, a, it's kind of a hot mess, right? The E3 schedule came out and people are a little confused because they didn't give times for a lot of things and that obviously makes it hard for us to schedule, but it doesn't matter. We're going to go through it. So starting on the 12th, on that Saturday, 6-12-2021, our E3 pre-show begins at 9 a.m. Central. And I want to make this very clear. Every time I give here, we'll be giving in the Central time zone because that is our time zone. That is Nintendo Prime's time zone. So you will need to convert that to Eastern, uh, Pacific, GMT, whatever. Just so you know, all Central time zone. All right, so at 9 a.m., our E3 pre-show begins. Uh, at 9.30 a.m., we'll be giving away our first giveaway. It's our first big giveaway of e3 literally a half hour into the opening stream at 10 a.m we're going to start talking about what uh, about who's showing games what, what companies are showing games uh that day happening at 10 a.m that's when we start to get into some of the companies we're maybe more excited for uh at 10 30 we'll be taking your questions from the chat uh answering your questions you have about e3 and the events of that day we're going to kind of focus on uh the companies going that day and, and what you guys want us to talk about with them at 11 a.m nate versus eric in smash bros that's right the Nate vs. Eric competition that's going to be happening all through E3, and I'm sure many of you will be keeping tally on who wins and who loses, uh, is going to happen uh, at 11, and the loser has to complete the Hot Chip Challenge, the official Hot Chip, chip Challenge. We got the real deal in here, not some cheap knockoff, so yeah, that's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, at 11.30, immediately following the Nate vs. Eric Smash Bros. and the Hot Chip Challenge, will be two items being given away uh so it is our second giveaway and it's going to include two items we're not going to tell you what these items are you guys will need to be there live to find out because bottom line is uh we don't want people to show up just for the giveaways or just for the giveaways they want to be there for we want people to come for the show so our second giveaway takes place at 11 30. also at 11 30 uh we're going to be getting our fan smash competition for a prize so we're gonna have a giveaway going on at the same time that we have a competition going on where one of you will be competing against us for a prize now to sign up to become the person to participate in that and get a chance to win a prize we have signups beginning tomorrow we will announce it all over social media and also during our live stream on friday as well i uh, will be announcing how you can sign up and uh, how that process works and how it's gonna work for future days and future competitions during E3 because we need to get all of our winners and, and all of our people who get a shot to play against us selected ahead of time just to keep the show concise. Trying to do it live is going to be a crap show. Um, next up at noon, the official E3 pre-show begins. This is when 
the ESA is starting their own pre-show. Now, we're going to be doing events throughout their pre-show. Uh, we will obviously move things around as we need to based on how their pre-show is going. Yeah, Greg Miller and the rest are probably going to be very entertaining, and there'll probably be some announcements in there. But obviously, we have our own show going on. Uh, so we'll, we'll have them playing for you guys, and there'll be some audio from it to be sure. Uh, but we're, we're going to turn that audio down throughout a lot of it and kind of do our own things and only turn it up uh, when it seems to be something that's highly relevant. Uh, but uh, speaking of that, uh, at 1230, we're going to have a member only conversation. So we're going to turn the chat down to members only for a little bit, for about a half hour, let our members get, get a say in. Uh, after all, they are some of the big supporters of the channel. I think it's just fair to give them a chance to have um, a, a chance for, for us to respond to them, uh, just like we gave the public earlier. Um, at 1 o'clock, at 1 p.m., we have our first Smash competition for a prize. So again, um, this is where a fan, or, or sorry, our second Smash competition for a prize. My, my bad. It's our second, so 1 p.m. is our second Smash competition for a prize. So we'll have two people facing off on uh, Friday uh, for, or sorry, on Saturday, June 12th for a prize. At 1.30, we begin our Ubisoft Expectations. So that's where we start getting uh, into the countdown, half hour away from Ubisoft. Let's talk about what we expect to happen. At 2 o'clock, at 2 p.m., we have the Ubisoft Forward. <sighs> Pretty exciting stuff there. Uh, after the Ubisoft Forward, immediately after the Ubisoft Forward, we have another giveaway happening. A giveaway number three of the day, I have it listed as, but it might not be giveaway number three. We'll get into that in a moment. Uh, and then we don't know when Gearbox Entertainment presentation has happened or Devolver, Devolver Digital's presentation. Those are still listed as TBA. Uh, and then we're going to have a two-hour post show that's also TBA because we don't know when everything wraps up. Also throughout the day, there will be nine other giveaways happening randomly that you will have no idea when they're happening, but we will. So again, it's one of those things. You want to check out all stream if you're trying to maximize your chance to win. Otherwise, just hopefully you enjoyed the show, enjoy our gaming conversations, and all of that jazz. I also want to note that not included on here yet because we don't have the schedule yet is Game Over Jesse will be coming on during our two-hour post show uh, as a special guest to talk about the day's events. Probably a lot of focus on Ubisoft, all that jazz. Moving on to day number two on Sunday. This is obviously the big Microsoft Bethesda day. Our E3 pre-show begins at 8 a.m. At 8.30 a.m., we will be doing another giveaway. At 9, we'll talk about who is showing games today. At 9.30, we'll get into some Microsoft predictions and talk. I believe we're going to be doing that with special guests, the Young Cavs. All three of the members of that team uh, should be coming on for that conversation. At 10 o'clock, we have another Nate vs. Eric gaming competition again, where the loser must dress as Tingle for the entire Microsoft press conference. So that's going to be a fun one. Uh, at 10.15, we got another giveaway happening. At 10.45 is when the official ESA-sponsored pre-show begins. Um, at 11.30, we're going to have a fan competition for a prize. And then at noon is Microsoft and Bethesda's showcase. Uh, followed up after that at 1 o'clock is the PC Gaming Show plus Future Game Show. And then we'll have a post-reaction and prep for Square Enix. Then Square Enix will be happening at 2.15. Uh, uh, they have about 40 minutes there, and then we'll have a post-reaction to that as well. And then we don't know when Warner Brothers, Black for Blood, or 24 Entertainment is happening. They're going to have features that day as well. And then we have a two-hour post-show there as well, with 12 surprise giveaways happening that day. So first they had nine surprise, second had 12. What happens on day number three? This is getting into Monday. All right, so on Monday, June 14th, our pre-show begins the earliest. It starts all of E3 at 7 a.m., we have our first giveaway of the day happening at 7.30, followed up at 8 o'clock, 8 a.m., with who is showing what today. So going over a, a, of what companies are going to be showing that day. At 8.30, we have another Nate vs. Eric competition where the loser must take three straight shots of tequila. Ooh, that's going to be a rough one. At 9 a.m., we have a member-only conversation period. Uh, at 9.30, we have a fan smash competition for prizes. At 10 o'clock, we have an official E3 pre-show that begins. So the official ESA stuff begins. At 10.15, we have another giveaway going on. And then we don't know, but there's gonna, supposedly going to be indie developer press conferences, Take-Two, Mythical Games, Freedom Games, Razer, and Capcom. There's also going to be features by Verizon and Intellivision. Again, we don't know what time zones are at. And then we're going to do a four-hour post-show, including 11 surprise giveaways. All that jazz. Monday is kind of the down period, so we have a lot of uh, competitions and stuff to, to, to really get going. Uh, and that four-hour post-show, of course, is going to end with um, some Nintendo conversation, because guess what happens 
at the next E3 event. Nintendo, baby. Let's get into the day of Nintendo. So, on 6-15-2021, so Tuesday, uh, we begin our pre-show again at 7 a.m. At 7.30, we have another giveaway. At 8 o'clock, we begin our final predictions featuring Andres Restart. Uh, at 8.45, we have another giveaway to happen. At 9 o'clock, another mem member-only conversation period. At 9.30, we have a fan competition uh, uh, where you guys compete against us for prizes. Uh, at 10 o'clock, we have the official E3 pre-show begins. At 10.15, we have another giveaway. Uh, at 10.30, the final hype train to Nintendo begins. Choo-choo! Here comes the train. Let's go, baby. Uh, at 11 o'clock, the Nintendo Direct begins. 40 minutes of goodness, followed by three hours of Nintendo Treehouse gameplay. We will be live reacting to all of it, likely popping off a few giveaways during it. Who knows? Maybe we'll wait. Uh, and then we have presentations by Bandai Namco, Eureka Games, and GameSpot, along with the official uh, E3 award show, which currently don't have times. Uh, and then we are doing a four- our reactionary post show. You know we'll be getting special guests in for that post show. We have 12 plus, that's right, 12 plus surprise giveaways happening in another time. And you might be going, but Nate, I thought you were giving hundreds of things. A lot of these giveaways contain multiple items. Some of them, you know, 10 plus items. So yeah, it's going to be awesome. Uh, we, we're going to have 12 plus giveaways on the final day special guests. We have other special guests we're still working out. We have a podcast that we're going to be doing as well during E3, likely uh, Tuesday evening. So we literally might get done with our E3 coverage, and it could be an hour later we begin again for the Nintendo Prime podcast, the, the post-E3 Nintendo Prime podcast. Well, we're clearly going to have a ton of stuff to talk about. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. There's going to be a couple other uh, competitions in there between Eric and I that we haven't really decided on all the punishments yet. Obviously, we have our E3 bets. We have to see what happens with that because I will do the punishments live on stream or do the giveaways live on stream. If you guys don't know what we're talking about, don't worry. We'll get into all of this Friday before E3 next week on our final live stream before E3 begins. Uh, so thank you guys so much for tuning in. Hopefully this makes a whole lot of sense to you. I did put up some nice pretty graphics for you guys to help keep things organized. These graphics will be um, reposted on social media uh, and I'll probably try to find a way to combine them uh, to put them out in a community post on YouTube as well. I'm going to do my best to make sure that you guys have access to the schedule. And yes, we will be updating the schedule as the days and the weeks go by. And obviously, you were probably hoping, hey, when are we going to hear about Switch Pro? I'd have no idea. Today, tomorrow, never beats the hell out of me. So today was about the E3 uh, schedule. We went through it. Hopefully, you guys are excited for what we're putting on. We have so many great guests coming on. And hey, for those that are worried about all the audio issues you've had, don't worry. I figured out what to do. I uh, got to change my setup a bit, but it's going to be pretty sick. Uh, so just stay tuned out for all of that. All right, guys. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm really excited about what we got going on for E3. I'm nervous and excited and um, know I'm going to be running on little sleep. It's going to be quite the show we've been putting on for you guys. And I hope you're looking forward to it. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I am Nathaniel Rubblejance from Nintendo Prime. Uh, this has been an awesome video. And I can't wait to catch you guys either in tonight's live stream because you guys know we're going live because it's, it's a Thursday. We go live Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. Uh, and if not, you know what? I'll catch you in my next video.